I don't have any idea at all how to create an app. I don't understand <laughs> any of it. Okay, thank you. Ask me another question. My son is a developer at Robinhood. My daughter, Jyoti, is a WWDC 2018 scholarship winner. My brother started and founded Yelp. Oh, yeah. Timeless. One drop. Sweater critters. Homer. Homer. You gotta look at her. My brother, Derek, created the app Refugees and Immigrants, the Creative. The Collective. Why did I say the Creative? At Christmas time, when most kids maybe would want skis or something, he wanted computer books. He stayed in his bedroom making games while the other kids were outside playing. And when she's really doing the coding, almost always we have to tell my daughter to stop. But then my daughter would be like, just give me another 10 minutes. You know, I want to get this solved first. <laughs> when I watch him code, his eyes move in a weird way and he's, he's like totally focused. Even when my friends are over, I'd say, well, look at Christopher, look at him. And they'd go, wow. When he first came to us with the idea, we were like, okay, good luck. <laughs> he started off in his small little one bedroom apartment with next to nothing and sacrifice eating a burger and just have ramen just so that he could, and I, I'm like, just buy the burger. And he's like, no, that's three bucks that I could put towards the app. Jeremy went out to build the first version of Yelp and it was a total bust, total failure. She tried really hard on a couple different titles and you've never heard of them. And, you know, that's, that's a really rough feeling. That was definitely a low point for Jeremy, because it was like, hey, we got to retool and try again. What Jeremy did notice in the data was that people loved writing comments. And that was really the genesis of the second version of Yelp, which worked. You have to be really OK with waking up to failure. And then at the end of a whole bunch of failures is something that's great. Tessa didn't really think, I want to make an app. Tessa found a problem of food waste, which you could use the app to help to solve. Emma's grandma was diagnosed with Alzheimer's. She even forgot my daughter's birthday. So Emma tried to search for an app that would help, uh, but she couldn't find it. So she said, you know, why don't we just do it ourselves? My husband was a diabetic. That inspired Jeffrey to do something about diabetes. And it's an answer to a lot of people's prayers. Jesse won the iPhone game of the year. I couldn't believe that he made it. I mean, to me, it was remarkable. She pulled out her cell phone, and I saw his app on her phone, and I was like, trying not to forget. Oh, my gosh. For my wife, it's not just creating. It's really wanting to be a part of something big. The one lesson that I learned from Jeremy every day is just that determination, tenacity, the focus. He foresaw the impact that the iPhone was going to have, and he bet everything on getting an app for it. And I think that it was one of the most important things that Yelp did. I think he's made a big difference, and so do thousands of other people. She wants to not just learn, I also teach others, and it makes me really proud to see her blossom. And as a parent, no better thing is that then your kids do what they want to do. Because it isn't how much money you've made, it's really what changes you've left behind. And she's hoping to leave a lot of change behind.